Okay. So um, we ended up with a pretty much a range bar, a shooting star. I suppose you could, not much of a gap there, but uh, it's an indecision bar. It's uh, pretty much a indecision pattern. And I think what we need to do is take cognos of this inside fractal here, because that's where the seller stepped in. And you look to the left, you can see why the seller stepped in there. There is a lot of resistance there. Okay, so if we just drill down to the three hour quickly, I've got a bit of a gap in the data. The trading station wasn't working this morning, uh, but you can see buyers stepping in here. This gap is still open, so I would anticipate that the gap closes. Um, I don't can't see the buyers just hanging around here. I think this is uh, people that are trying to ambush us at the moment, so looking for an opportunity to get in early. Uh, I personally think we're probably going to pull back to the gap, possibly even as far as 26400. Um, there's a lot of support down there. That would make a lot of sense for me and get me pretty interested in a long. Uh, at the moment, um, we're sort of just hovering around here. Nothing much that I can see here. But in saying that, any positive price action on the 15 minutes of the 26600 or of the 26400 area is going to get me long. Okay, um, that's pretty much my plan of action for today. Bit of a messy day yesterday. Nice move to the upside, but then we retraced and then sort of half-heartedly made a move to the upside. Um, would I look for shorts here? Definitely not. Why not? Because we're in an upward trend. Okay, and uh, I'm taking my trend off the eight hour. Doesn't matter which way you look at this. Low, higher, low, higher, low, higher, low. Trend is up. I'm looking for opportunities to buy. Okay, so I would like to see a pullback though. Um, this eight hour price action here, we've got a rejection bar off the level there. So I would like to see that play out, just coming back down, nice deep pullback into 26,400 area. Um, that would get me in for a reasonable long. Otherwise, it's a day of five and 50 minute trading and we're gonna be looking for an opportunity of a 50 minute level um, to get in long. Okay, at the moment we are range bound, pretty clear you can see we are going sideways. And uh, we do have more results coming out, obviously, today. We've got data coming out later this afternoon. So we might be, might be range-bound for most of the day unless we get some kind of a catalyst coming in and driving um, price in a direction. Okay, so anyway, that's my attitude today is really look for opportunities to buy and uh, looking a little bit further down. I hope it helps, and we'll catch up with you later. Cheers for now.